What's up, y'all? It's Red Pill Vegan. Today, we're going to do a video comparing two types of turmeric, one of which you may not have tried before. So what you're looking at right here is the traditional curcuma longa, the yellow turmeric. This is the turmeric you will find in health food stores or Indian markets near you. And then on the right over here, we have a different type of turmeric, which is called white turmeric. Now, the technical name of this I'm going to put on screen. It is curcuma zedoaria, or zedoary for short. Now, this looks like ginger. Let me be clear, guys. This is not ginger. This is a type of turmeric in the curcuma family, and it is a white turmeric. So what's the difference between these two, guys? Well, y'all already know about uh, curcumin, curcuma longa, and the health benefits of that, so I'm not going to go into it here. But the traditional yellow turmeric is kind of bitter, has kind of a pungent mustardy smell. You know, you use it for curries and things like that. But over here with this guy, we're talking about a little bit different smell overall. It smells kind of like mango, and it tastes more similar to ginger. So I know you guys have tried fresh ginger before. If you like turmeric, but you've never tried white turmeric, I would highly recommend it. And you know we've all we've all got some turmeric powder, you know we use this stuff. But I'm gonna encourage you guys to get some fresh turmeric if you can find it. <clears throat> it may be expensive at your health food store, but I was able to pick these up at $4.99 a pound at my local Indian market. So check out your Indian community. They may have some of the ingredients that you would spend big bucks on at the health food store, fresh for much cheaper. And if you want to include this in your diet, here's a great tip, guys. I cut them up just like this into thin discs, and then I put them in Ziploc bags in the freezer, just like that. So that's gonna be my pro tip. That way, next time you're making a curry or you're making lentils in your Instant Pot, go ahead and toss in, instead of using the, the typical dry powder, Go ahead and make it make it official, man. Throw in some fresh ginger that you've got in your freezer. Package just like this. Some fresh ginger can do the same thing. Some fresh turmeric. Yeah, do it. Do it fresh, guys. Get the ingredients in their whole food form, not dehydrated as a powder. And see if you don't enjoy the flavor and the health benefits at a higher level. Because that's what it's really all about. You getting healthy and enjoying the flavor of the foods that you eat. If you can't find white turmeric fresh locally, they do sell the powder on Amazon, and I'll put a link in the description. People are using it to do all kinds of crazy stuff, like dye their hair, but if you want to enjoy the flavors of this, this is white turmeric versus yellow turmeric or orange turmeric, and now you've seen it up close and personal. And hey, before you go, if you like delicious flavors from around the world, then the best tip I can give you is to make it count when you buy your staple foods like rice, like basmati rice. You see, not all rice was created equal. And when you're going to buy something that you're going to enjoy for many different meals, like a big bag of rice, it really counts to spend a few extra bucks and get the right one. So that being said, guys, there are some comparison videos of the top brands, like what they reach for during Indian wedding season on my channel. And I'm going to go ahead and put a link so you can watch those videos by clicking the thumbnail that pops up right now. All right, y'all know what time it is. Red Pill Vegan, next.